once you sign in to your OneDrive uh, in your web browser, what happens is that you get to this piece right here. And this is the interface that you see uh, when you sign into onto your OneDrive if you haven't made any changes. Over here on the top, you can see that uh, there's the different sections of OneDrive right here. So you can access out your files right here. So you can see all of your main files allocated over here. Besides that, you can go around and see the recent section, the recent files that you may have access over here. And if any, uh, you have any photos on your OneDrive, you'll see it on the photos section. And if you were to click on it, you can see that you get on to the photos section right here. If you were to go around onto the shared section, then you see all of the files that you have shared with others. And then whatever files you may have deleted, you'll see it over here under recycle bin. So in this tutorial series, we're going to take a look at uh, different sections over here. So once this is done, you can see that if I were to uh, go around on the bottom, you can see the total space that you have utilized in OneDrive as well and how much is remaining over here on the bottom. If I were to click on the nine dot uh, uh, icon right here, then you'll be able to uh, uh, access the shortcuts of other web apps right here. And if you were to go to all apps, then you have access to uh, other Microsoft apps from over here as well. Let me just go around and click outside. And over here, you can see that on the top, you have the option to create new files in OneDrive. So if I were to click on this, you can go around and then create out different files like forms, OneNote notebook, PowerPoint presentation, Excel, a workbook or Word document, and even plain text document as you can see right there. Over here on the top, you get the option to upload out files and folders. And over here, you have access to the view option like short, and then whether you want to see tiles or list or compact list and see the information over here as well. On the top, you have access to your settings right here and the upgrade option and the language option. And over here on the top, you can see that you have access to your Microsoft account as well. And that is how you can go around and then explore out the uh, 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 interface to get familiar with it as well. So do get familiar with the interface. And this is what we're going to work with throughout the tutorial series. On the top, you can see that you also have access to search everything. So this, uh, if you were to search for anything, then it allows you to search for different files uh, within OneDrive over here. And that is how you can go around and then um, uh, utilize the interface. Um, uh, and you can see that a lot of things are provided right off in the main interface itself. But we are going to explore even more deeper um, as we progress along. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.